During the fiercest storm he could remember, the Black Knight left Cracked Rock Castle, his horse flinching at each flash of lightning and the thunder that followed. The road that led to the ancient castle was slick with rain, the cobbles making bolt slip and skid as the Black Knight spurred him onward. He was heading for his fastest ship, the Dragon's Tooth, which was tied up in the busy harbour of the trading town at the foot of the King's Road. The steep route wound its way down from Cracked Rock Castle to the town of Andover, which overlooked the deep waters of Andover Loch. Sparing no time, the Black Knight galloped through the now quiet, cobbled streets that hummed with activity during the day. More than one resident muttered a curse as they were woken by the clatter of hooves. Bolt surged up at the timber gangway and on to the dragon's tooth, the Black Knight leaping from its back onto the empty deck. When he peered out of his cabin window that overlooked the deck, Captain Courtney spat out his tea in surprise and rushed out of his warm cabin and into the stormy night on deck. "'My lord, I wasn't expecting you!' The captain brushed the tea from his tunic and ushered the Black Knight into his cabin. The captain hurriedly cleared some papers from his chair, but the Black Knight didn't sit.' 